Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Adamu Plays Timber and Stone. As you can see, the worst has finally happened. We have ourselves a necromancer. They have found us. At long last, they have found us. But we are prepared. Uh, they so we had this uh, skeletal infantry was spotted by Louis here, and I went in to, to check him out, thinking it was just another uh, skeleton horde or whatever. And to my surprise, there was a necromancer right here. I saw the there was some trees on fire, and so I am quite uh, quite uh, quite alarmed. I am not going to lie. I am a little terrified that he is going to kill everybody. Which would be terrible. So I'm going to tell Louis to retreat. I'm going to pull him back here. And let's just check make sure. Yep. And, okay. Another skeleton infantry was spotted. I'm not ready to say attack them yet. So what we need to do is we need to just have everybody... Suit up. Everybody's infantry. Uh, yep. Well, hold on. Let's think about this. All right, so... All right, no, let's make you... Let's not make everybody. I don't want everybody going at them, because that could be disastrous. But we'll have some people. We'll have Thomas. So you'd be a farmer. Back again. Forager. Uh, Louis. Uh, we don't need your services. Stonemason. Uh... Miner, you keep on mining. Builder, we need you, Humphrey. You just got married. You can't be dying on us. So we'll make... Oh, Kate, you're you're also... Yeah, let's not use Kate. Uh, our new herder, you know what? Let's make you... We can afford to lose you herding so hard. Hate to say it. And we have Gwynergard, who's our, who I've posted at a... At a uh, actually, at an at a infantry uh, guarding position here. And we have our new recruit... Uh, Lit Letitia, Letitia. I have no idea how to spell that name, or pronouncing that name. I can spell it because it's right there. Anyway, and so that's one, two, one, two, three, four. And um, let's add a couple more people. How about more gain? And Alden, the new people. <laughs> the new people. They're expendable. Let's face it. They're the red shirts. And while we're at it, uh, let's have them equip some shields. They're going to want that extra protection when facing off with the Necromancer. So we just cycle through uh, to our uh, infantry and give them all shields. Shields. Oop, no, I don't. You don't have to have two shields. Just one shield's enough. Uh, shield, shield, shield. Oop, nope, no shield. Yeah, shield. And. Yeah, shield. And I think that's, what, I had five of them? Or six? Or something? Like that? Yeah. Okay, we're good. Alright. And uh, let's just uh, keep an eye on things. Hopefully Louis here will run for his life. Please. Can you run for your life faster? <laughs> oh, he's got a lot of stuff on him. So he is going to be a little on the slow side. Hopefully... He can... Alright, yeah, you just go ahead and attack that guy. Oh my god. Oh my god, don't die. Just keep moving, buddy. Keep moving. Uh, if you keep moving, he should be okay. Oh my god, he's like moving just fast enough for him not to get hit. And the necromancer is catching everything on fire. He's burning down my trees. That is fantastic. Oh my god. This is like a slow motion high speed car chase on foot. Um, oh my god. This is terrifying. Like just a couple hits from this guy and he's pretty much done for. Ooh. This is not good. So let's go ahead and let's have him charge. Let's have everybody charge this enemy. And hopefully, sometime has passed, they'll, they'll, they'll be smart enough. Yeah, it looks like they got some shields going. Yeah. Or, oops. Hold on, there's a mountain in the way. 
Do these guys have shields? Or, yeah, they some of them have shields. Uh, I should have had a few shields. I don't know if I had enough shields for everybody. But hopefully they'll be able to rescue Louie here from imminent death. And maiming and uh, all that glory stuff. Alright, and... Alden, Alden. Ooh, my god! You almost did! Alden! You almost died. Okay. Wow. Alright. So one skeleton down. I don't know how many skeletons there are. Alden, you need to chill out. You have taken serious mortal wounds. You can go back to being... Um... So what were you? Uh, you were the wood chopper. Oh, I don't like that. The wood chopper, you'll go out and chop wood and potentially run into danger. So we are going to... Have you... Um... You can be the herder temporarily just to get you out of the way. Uh-huh. And you... I wish there was like a panic button where you could tell him just to go to the hall. So yeah, you get away. You get away now. Get back, get away. Um, can we have you do something? Just don't do, just don't do anything. Alright, just don't, don't do anything. And just wait in the hall. Wait over, wait in the hall. Uh, while you do nothing. Okay. Uh, should we get one more person in? Uh, in on this, so we have some... Who, who, who can we spare? Who can we spare? Uh, Kate, you're our good engineer. We can't, we can't spare you. Uh, Miner, maybe. Oh yeah, these are all like very high level guys. We cannot afford to lose any of them. Del Lawrence, we don't need you, Del Lawrence. I'm sorry, you are expendable. All right, let's get you a shield as well. Oh my God. Okay. Uh. I'm really, 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 really not happy about all of this. But what you're going to do, we've got to take care of this necromancer. Um, is he all by himself? Are there no other? Was that just that one other skeleton? Surely not. I do not see any, though. Oh, we got some. Here we go. Got some down here. That's a tree stump. Okay. Uh... Do we have no one else for him to see? I thought he had another one. No? Okay, that's weird. He spotted him twice, apparently. Or the same one was spotted twice? Alright, so, let's just, uh... Where are you guys going? Are you equipping? What you doing? You have a shield, right? Where are you going? Anna? Stay idle. I don't know where they're going. They're not supposed to do anything except stand there. Let's double check these guys. Let's make everything... It, our ducks are in and dotted. And our T's are in a line. And our eyes are crossed. Okay? Oh, ooh, combat train. Combat train. No, you stay idle for now. Uh, this is your final training. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, and you are set to stay idle. Alright, let's just have everybody... Let's just have everybody move up this way. One at a time. Because, you know, there's no unit selection in this game yet. Although, I hear plans that they are attempting... Or they are going to have that in the next update. That would be amazing if that could be a thing. So let's try to sneak up behind him. Or while well, he's looking this other way, because he is... Um, he hates trees, the necromancers. They Trees are their immortal enemies. They despise and hate them. And will do anything to destroy them all. Uh, they hate trees more than they hate us. So we will use that to our advantage. Let's, uh... Well, let's just ignore that guy. Actually, let's not ignore that guy. Well, he's no, he's pretty far away... Hmm. I think he should be fine. Ignore him. He is not a threat as much as the Necromancer is. Alright, so we just need to have somebody... Let's cancel charge on this guy, actually. We don't want them all running off while they're so close. Alright, we just need one person to spot the Necromancer. And we can do something about it. We can actually charge the Necromancer and defeat him. 
Oops. Alright, have they spotted? Yes, they have spotted the necromancer. So let's charge. No, I do not. No. <laughs> Remove the stun later. Charge an enemy. Charge! Let's see, okay, the necromancer still has not spotted us. The fool. He has turned it back on us. That is the last mistake he will ever make. Can they slay the beast? Get him! Oh. oh my god, more gain. You have taken... Serious injury, I need you to back off. And we killed him! We killed him! Oh, Morgan, you did it! Oh, you sweet, sweet woman. <laughs> yes, we are victorious. Oh, but the battle is not quite over yet. We still have this one necrom... This one... Not necrom... The one skeleton left, so let's charge him. And... Oh, good old... Uh, good old Louie, gathering, gathering corpses. Let's actually make you... What do you have? Are you... No, you're still injured. Never mind. You're still injured. Morgan, we will turn you into... Back into... You can return to being a miner. These three should be enough to handle this one... Oh! Got the burps. Handle this one skeleton. Um, surely he is not the only, those weren't the only, the necromancer did not have only two. The necromancers can actually spawn in, uh, skeletons. Oh no, there's a bunch over here I didn't even see. Wow, where are they? What the? Are you seeing? Am I? Is this right? Are they underground? Oh my god, they are. How are they underground? This is very bizarre. I have not seen this before. It's a very strange... What are you doing, Morgan? Uh -huh. Do you have nothing to mine? Do you actually have nothing to mine? Let's tell her to wait in the hall while idle. Let's get her out of here. I'm very confused by these skeletons. They're stuck in the ground, but that's fine, I guess. I, I don't... Will they be there forever? I don't know. That's very curious. Very strange thing indeed. Oh, and they killed... Oh, I didn't even see them. Very good. No one died. Yeah, how, how injured are they? Were they injured at all during that fight? No. Okay, good. Hey, we're all good. What you know it? We actually came out of that relatively... Oh, well, a few people escaped. But we came out of that relatively uh, secure. So that's uh, that's fantastic, actually. Wow, we handled that very well. I had uh, nightmares <laughs> about uh, necromancers coming in and killing them. Our worst fears have been realized, but we have we have come through the the, 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 the adversary. We've gotten taken care of him, and we have come through this uh, challenge stronger for it, or something something like that. Yeah. Okay, I guess you can go back to being to combat training and. The other two, you, Gwyn, the guard, you're still a guard. Let's go back to that, and you can go back to being a builder, and you can go back to being a herder, and we're good. Thomas, you can go back to being a carpenter. Yeah, you can do that. All right, then. Well, whew. Oh, that's over with. Thank God. <laughs> Uh, also, let's turn our engineer, Kate, let's turn you into an engineer. Where's engineer? And let's have you rebuild those targeting dummies. Alright, well, I'm going to return once it's daylight. I will be right back. Alright, everybody, we're back. It's daytime. And uh, we are working here up at the future castle. And I've already built some walls, and I'm putting in some stairs. If we go to designations, you can see where I'm putting in some stairs. Put some more scaffolding over here. And these two are confused. <laughs> Cannot get... Well, go do a different desired target. How about that? Let me work on something else. Uh, this is kind of an oversight of mine. I guess I need to put some scaffolding up over here as well for them to reach this area. I didn't really think about that. But uh, no biggie. We just uh, put some scaffolding down for them, and they will be just fine. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Eh, probably fine. 
<laughs> and, all right. What else do we got to do? And so yeah, so I'm going to finish. They're going to finish this kind of layer, and then I'm going to put a floor in. And at this, maybe I go up one. I think about maybe going up one here. So this, so there's uh, so there's a little bit more room. So the floor's not quite flush with this. I think that's a good idea. And so I think this would be like uh uh I think I like to put the I like I like the idea of putting in the forge down here maybe. Or maybe have this be the forge area. And this be kind of like store some storage, some chests and stuff here. And then have the masonry over here instead. And maybe this also be storage. And eventually this is going to be kind of like a tower thing going on. And then the second la level, I guess the first is sort of like the basement. This is going to be, maybe be the new hall area. Like the new temporary hall maybe. I don't know. Or just like a meeting area. We'll figure that out as we go. As we go. And... Also... I am going to dig this out, make this prettify, prettify this a little bit, some more, so it's not just like cut in the dirt. Uh, so we've got this flooring; it's been all finished. We've got some new storage in here. We got this one staircase. I haven't been digging that out uh, quite yet. I haven't started because. I had designated a lot of metals and stuff on surface metal speed dug and they just hadn't been getting around to it because I kept having the miners do mining out areas and stuff and I just decided I was just going to not designate any new stuff until they had finished there's some coal there but I don't really care about that finished digging out all this ore so which I have finally done that and as you can see they have been doing the work and we got a couple spots here left yeah uh, here and there. I don't think I... Eh, I don't really care. It's coal. I don't care. I don't care. We've got a lot of stuff. If you look down here, we have 136 iron, 75 coal, and 60 tin. So we've got a lot of metal. So our metal shortage has finally been solved. Uh, we have plenty of people that we got a couple of idle. I don't really care. We've got so many people, I don't really have anything else extra for them to do anyway. I guess I could turn them to miners, but, eh. Uh, they, you know, they can, they, they've been doing a lot of work. They've been working really hard. They deserve some downtime. So I, I think I'm just going to leave them, leave them as is. Uh, till I, till I change my mind. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. So that's how it's going. So it's going pretty well. It's just starting to look really nice. I'm going to put in the flooring here. Yeah, it's looking really good, really good. Alright, well, thank you guys so much for watching. I am Adamo, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye!